Hi, it's me. I am Kaniski, and I want to do just a quick video on the fro, fo, fro hog um, on a TWA. I've seen this a few times on YouTube, but the um, the tutorial that I really liked was by the Pretty Life. I'll have her name in the video description box so that she can get credit. She had a really, really good video on it, and I wanted to try it. Um, so I'm starting off on freshly washed hair um, and conditioned. What I'm using, what I was holding up is Shine and Jam Silk Edges because my hair is really thick and I wanted it to kind of lay down a little bit. Um, I really had to kind of manipulate it a lot to get it to blend in but um, overall it worked out pretty good. So that's all I'm doing in the first few minutes of the video is trying to um, disperse that product in my hair and kind of get it to lay down and do what I want it to do and that it didn't take very long um, I did run into some issues with uh, just getting the ponytail shaped and getting it in place I'm not sure if the size that I had was the largest but the actual opening on the drawstring afro puff was not as big as I thought it was gonna be so it took a little bit of manipulation to get it to stretch from um, almost top to bottom so like I said here I'm just combing and brushing um, that was a pretty good product that I used I really like like the product it says it's labeled good for natural hair um, it's supposed to be free of alcohol and parabens enriched with silk protein it states it has olive oil now here's where it starts to get interesting um, I get ready to put it on I'm excited I'm putting a little bit of gel I was just using some cheap softy extra whole protein styling gel just to kind of help I got the drawstring ponytail on and then I figured out whoa this is really not a huge ponytail it was really short it was fully open and it wouldn't really stretch so that is where um, things kind of stop for me and it took about 45 minutes but 45 minutes later this is what I wound up with and I think it did pretty good I must say that it took me a lot of manipulation I ended up having to cut the ponytail because my husband said it looked a little too bulky and false I did go ahead and have my barber um, line me up all the way around just to make it kind of blend and look a little bit more natural this is a side view um, it took several hairpins and I didn't this is just a shot of how well it blended from my natural hair to the ponytail um, I also want to say that this is a real picture of my hair when I had it cut in that style just to show that it did look a little bit um, it did kind of resemble my natural hair when I had my hair cut in that style I was really really pleased with um, how well everything matched up and I just want to say um, I really love the style I was really concerned most about not having a lot of hair um, and about the the drawstring ponytail moving or you know not having enough faith that it was going to stay in place but actually I've been wearing it now for about five or six days I've slept in it and it has it feels really secure and I don't believe it's going anywhere and um I, it took a little bit of work but now that I know how it works I believe I can do it again in much less time I really do like this style and I recommend it for anybody who's TWA and wants to try something a little bit different um so this is just my video on it I'm sorry I didn't get into a lot of detail about the cutting and the manipulation of the hair but it's really going to depend on your preference how big you like it how full you want it to look the shape that you want it to be how much hair you want the position you want it on your head so um i think that's going to come down to more personal preference anyway but this is just my um my tutorial on it i've gotten a lot of compliments and people actually been trying to figure out if it's my real hair or not and uh, i'll play with them and say oh yeah i just picked out my my small afro and you know shrinkage is real but um, here it is for everybody who's been wondering 
how I got my hair that way or what exactly I did. I didn't glue it. I actually just pinned a drawstring ponytail and blended it in. So anyway, stay tuned for more videos. I hope this helps someone and please check out, you know, more information in the video description box. Thank you for watching. Peace, love, and harmony. Till next time.